Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the double catapult. Now, we've already taught you the catapult, but this has an extra flourish on there for you. Okay, so if you thought the catapult was hard, <laughs> uh, you're in trouble. Try this one. <laughs> this is a little bit harder. Okay, it's called a double catapult for a reason, okay? And it looks like this. Here we go. Seven, eight, and the way, raise, step, prepare, spin, offer, step, spin, with, return, return. and back. And I forgot the return at the end. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, guys right to ladies right. Okay, we're going to lead our partner away. Now, if you don't know how to do the catapult, you might want to... Uh, Look up there. Look up there, yeah. where I'll link to the original mm -hmm. catapult mm -hmm. teach. So we lead away. Step to your left, creating space on your right-hand side. Now you're going to pull and raise with the right hand to turn your partner anti-clockwise for the first part of the catapult. Mm -hmm. Nikki's going to go under my right arm as I step into the slot with my right foot. Nikki's back on her... On my right foot, about to step on my left. Okay, I'm going to offer my spare hand behind my back, which Nikki will take. I did. My weight's on my right foot. I'm going to take my left foot behind me, creating space on my left-hand side as Nikki steps forward on her... Right foot. Ready for the spin. Okay, from here, I'm going to spin Nikki in a clockwise direction as I pull and let go with the left hand. Let go with the right, otherwise you're going to break your arm. Mm -hmm. So you're going to pull with this. As you do, you turn your back on your partner as I turn anti-clockwise and offer both hands behind my back for a second go at the catapult. My weight is on my right foot. Ladies, you're back on the right, ready to step forward on the right for that second spin. I'm taking my left foot behind me, out of the slot, bringing Nikki in, forward on her... Right foot. I let go with my right hand. I'm going to spin Nikki for the second time, clockwise. So pull with the left hand, spin, Catch with the left, lead Nikki back on the right. Now, because Nikki's turned clockwise twice, we have to unwind her, okay? Otherwise, she'll start getting really dizzy. Mm -hmm. So we do a return, which means we just raise the left hand, turn Nikki anti-clockwise. As she comes round to face, we lower and step away. Okay, from this side. Right to right. Here we go. Lead away with the right hand. Step into your left, creating space. My weight's on my left foot. I'm going to raise the right hand, step into the slot with my right foot, offering the spare hand. Left foot comes behind me, creating space on my left hand side as Nikki steps forward on her right foot, ready for the spin. I pull, spinning Nikki clockwise as I turn anti clockwise to offer. Step into the slot with my right foot, offer both hands, take my left foot behind me, out of the slot, Nikki steps forward on the right foot again, I pull, let go with the left hand, I nearly did it again then. <laughs> <laughs> the that triple that, catapult. That, that would have been the triple catapult, <laughs> offer the left, <laughs> Nikki steps back on the right, we, do, we add a return to unwind her so she doesn't get dizzy. We step in, face to face, elbow to elbow, Ish. lower, and step away. Okay. I have no idea how many beats this is. Let's find out how many beats they it is. kind of blend into one another, don't they? After okay. A while. Uh, we'll do it to a slow count and see what happens. Here we go. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, Ooh. seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven beats, okay. apparently. Good for today. Okay, here we go again from this side. And five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Unbelievable. We got it right okay. both times. Yay. Okay, last time from this side. Okay. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yay. Okay, if you enjoyed that move, you know what to do. Tell all your friends, like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Cheers all. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the grapevine. Okay, it looks like this. We always do a demo first. Seven, eight. Away, in, turn, and face, turn, face, turn. Face, turn, face, turn. We step under, and then we're going to finish with a spin. Catch in left to right. Okay, teach it from this side as we normally do first. It's a left hand to right handed move. And we're going to lead our partner away as we normally do with the left hand, creating space on my right hand side as I step to the left on my left foot. Nikki's back on her right foot. It's very similar to a first move. So we're going to bring our partner into step like so. As she steps, Nikki's going to pivot on that foot. So I'm going to take my right hand to the far shoulder, twist Nikki out, and she'll step back on the right, right foot. foot. Mm -hmm. Now, what we will do is we will pivot and step forward on the left foot, going palm to palm with the left hand, and my right hand goes on Nikki's nearest shoulder blade, which is the... Left one. Left one, yeah. okay. At this point, we create what's called frame. Mm. So I'm just going to let go. Frame is this, okay? So it's a nice rigid, mm -hmm. not rock solid, but you create some sort of tension there to create a frame. So with the frame, we now I bring Nikki forward to face. So she steps forward on the... Right foot. I'm stepping to face on my left foot. So we're now literally just face Let's to face. Let's do a circle. Let's show them. So we're like this. We're like this. Okay. And in frame. Okay. From here. Which way do we, <laughs> which way do we go? Oh, totally, that way. Oh, that way. Yeah. Totally lost where we were. So I'm going to pivot Nikki. So she steps back on the... Left foot. And I step forward on my right foot. Then, with my weight on my right foot, I turn to face Nikki and we end up face to face like we did before. Then we do one more step as Nikki steps forward on the... Left foot. And I'm back on my right foot. So that's the end of that sequence. We're now going to go back the same way. Okay? The back the way that we came. So we go face to face. So I pivot on my left foot. To I face. I step forward on my left. We pivot. I'm putting the weight on my right foot. Left foot for ladies. So this is a bit weird for the chaps. I'm stepping backwards, like so. Then yes. weight on my left foot and face. Pivot on my right foot and step on my left. Nikki's back on her right. I am. Mm -hmm. And then to exit the move, we do a half. So we face pivot and at this point we raise our left hand Nikki's going to go under the left hand down the slot I follow but because I know I'm doing another move down the slot I stay out of the slot I take my left hand forward Nikki's forward on her right foot mm -hmm. and that's what she'll spin on I'm now going to pull and spin Nikki in a clockwise direction catch left to right and I'm back into the slot okay from this side that's a lengthy teach oh, okay. <laughs> That's a really long teach. It is. Okay, here we go. Lead away, creating space on my right-hand side, stepping out of the slot on my left foot. Like a first move, I collect on the right shoulder, go palm to palm, pull, and pivot Nikki back. So she's back on her... Right foot. I've pivoted on my right foot and step with my left foot like so. We then go face to face. Then... Turn, pivot, and step. So I'm forward on my right foot. Nikki's back on her. On my left. We face, so I pivot on my right and face. Keep turning, back on my right, and Nikki's forward on her. Left. Then we go back the other way. We go forward, pivot on the left foot, and face. Keep turning, step back, face, keep turning and step left. Then we're going to exit the move. So we face, keep turning, raise the left hand. Nikki goes under it. 
I stay out of the slot because I'm going to do a spin on the left hand. Nikki <laughs> nearly went on her own steam there. I'm going to spin Nikki clockwise, catching left to right. Okay, let me go through the ladies' footwork. We've been doing it just as we've been going through the teach. However, I'm just thinking about what I'm doing. There's a lot of transferring the weight from the left to the right foot, and it's almost like you're walking through the move. It feels quite natural. So as you go into the first move, you'd automatically step back on your right foot. So as Jim's bringing me round, I automatically go right, left, right, left. And then I feel this sort of block. So then I'm being pushed back the other way. So then weight's on the right foot, so I go back on the left, forward on the right, left, and then I feel another stop. Okay, and then I'm being pulled again, so I'm right, left, and then under. Okay, do a little turn. Spin and yeah. catch. So it should feel quite natural to just do stepping through the move because the man will lead you through it. And the lead, chaps, mm -hmm. all comes from this arm here, mm -hmm. okay, connected to your core. So your core is here. I create tension here, and this is my core going through my arm into the palm to palm. Not bad, not bad. Thank you very much. Yes. And my right hand on the shoulder blade allows me to move Nikki like so, okay, through my core. Okay, so the lead comes from the right hand, the left yeah. hand, but it's my core that does the turning, okay? I'm not, I'm not doing this no. with my arms, okay? I'm not doing this. It all comes from the core as we step. Okay, last time from this side. Here we go, lead away. And step here. And then we go face, step, face, back. And face, step, face, back. And exit, under, prepare, spin, catch, left. Okay, let's try it to a count. Okay. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six. I have no <laughs> idea how many beats I've lost count. I can't count the beats. Well, we're going into the wall then. Right. Don't worry. I'll lead you. It's okay. fine. We'll carry on. I'll do, try again. I was counting the beats. I've lost <laughs> my, uh, my footwork. Here we go. <laughs> Five, six. Seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> I can't count count and do it at the same time. Me, then. Just let's just do it. <laughs> Someone else count. Here we go. Five, Winnie, count. Six, seven, eight. Away, in, step, and face, step, face, step. Have I done it wrong again? No, no. That's you, isn't it? No, we're not going too far. Hang on. Sorry about this. Five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. And away. It's, just, it's the beat thing. It's, okay. get, it's driving me nuts. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Here we go. Da, 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 da. How many beats? 15. 15. Our 15 adjudicator, beats. Winnie, has told us it's 15 beats. Right, I'm going to try and count the beats this time. Okay, here we go. I've had no beer today as well. None. That's half the problem, I think. Quick, here we go. get him some beer. Five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven eight, no. nine, <laughs> ten, 11, 12, 15, 14, 15, 15 yeah. beats. I knew it. That was okay. hard work. <laughs> last one, last one. Here we go. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. Away and back and step, step and step, step and under and prepare, spin. Um, right. that'll do, that'll do. Okay, if you like that, I don't know why you would, but anyway, if you've got any of that, well done. Um, please subscribe, like, share, um, and we'll see you on the next move. 
Bye. And if you think you can count the beats and do that <laughs> at the same time, oh, yeah, video it, it yeah. and upload it and send us a link. Sounds good. I don't think it can be done. <laughs> okay, there's a challenge for you. All right, till next time. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Hi everyone, welcome to Smooth Jive. We are Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the right pass Archie, and it looks like this. Okay, so right hand and move. Here we go. Seven, eight. Away, turn, round, and step. Okay, right hand and move for the guys. Ladies, right. I'm just going to, oh, my mic leads pulling my head back. There we go. Mm. We're going to lead our partners away. As we do, we're going to step to the left, chaps. Okay, create some space on our right. Now, my weight's going to go on my left foot. As I bring Nikki past me with my right hand, so I'm going to lead Nikki past me. My weight stays on my left foot. I'm raising my right hand to start turning her anti-clockwise. Now, we'll get Nikki in position, so she's facing back down the slot where she came from, mm -hmm. feet together. What we do, chaps, is we step in with our right foot. So I literally kept the weight on my left foot, brought my right foot round, and on the ball of my right foot, I'm going to come in like so, spin under clockwise, under my own arm, like so, all the way round to face your partner, and then you lower and step with your partner in. So let's try that from this side. As you can see, ladies, I'm not doing anything really. It's quite an easy move for me. I'm not <laughs> spinning or anything. The only, the only tip I would give you is that when you've got your hand with the guys held quite high, keep a strong arm because you're actually helping him to do the spin. Okay, right to right, lead away, step to the left out of the slot. Now, again, weight on my left foot. Nikki's going to pass me on my right as I raise my right hand. I step in with my right foot, and on the ball of my right foot, I come round, complete turn clockwise to face my partner, lower, and step with your partner. So ladies, all I do is I step back on my right foot, as we usually do with this type of move. Now, very important about this move, when you lead your partner away, you're going to Bring this right hand up to bring your partner into your right hand side. It's very important that your partner, when you do this, does not travel backwards. Mm -hmm. Now, if Nikki does travel backwards and I try and do this move, I will literally get pulled off balance and go under the arm. So, Nikki has to literally stay right by me in order for me to spin yeah. on my core. The minute she pulls me off my core, the move fails. So, so one might ask, how would I know that I need to keep my hand up? Kind of difficult to explain, but the fact that Jim keeps that hand above his own head, I'm not moving anywhere. I'm not going to take it um, out just because I want to. I know that he's kept me there for a reason. So I'm going to lead away. As Nikki starts to pass me, my right foot goes in, and the idea of this move is you do it quickly and with your partner, okay? Now, my hand, when it goes over my head, literally directly over my head, I hold it in position. So even if I get pulled off, it pulls my whole body. What you don't want is your arm getting pulled and you try mm. to spin, that really doesn't work. So, from this side, it goes away, raise step, full turn, whoop, and in with your partner. Ignore that. Bit. I'm not to do that. Okay, from this side. <laughs> oh, okay. It's actually really hard to do this move slowly. It is. <laughs> okay, lead away. Raise. And this is the turn. Round. Okay, let's do it quickly. It's so much better. <laughs> I'm going to count you in. It does not work when you do it slowly. <laughs> okay, seven, eight. It goes a one, two, Three, four. There you That's go. Better. Yeah, much better. Is that four beats? I, I don't know. I'm just pleased that you I made did, it round. I counted four. <laughs> Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, and four. Yeah, four beats. Yeah. From this side, five, six, seven, eight, and one. 
two, three, and four. Yeah, <laughs> sort of okay, that move. Okay, if you like that move, please subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Cheers, all. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the shoulder sway. Okay, it's a uh, right. right to right move. I knew that. <laughs> okay, right to right move. This is the demo, so it looks like this. Seven, eight, and away. Shoulder, step, step, turn, and back. Okay, right to right hand and move. We normally start on this side, so we're going to lead our partner away with the right hand. I'm stepping to the left with my left foot, creating space on my right hand side. Nikki's back on her right foot <laughs> from here. I'm going to pull with the right hand, but I'm going to raise it and take it to Nikki's... Right shoulder. Right shoulder. It's the nearest shoulder. As I raise it, her nearest shoulder will be on the other side. So I pull. Nikki's going to turn anti-clockwise, so it goes to her nearest shoulder on the shoulder. At this point, we're feet together. Then I'm going to can pull. I, can, can I just yes. say something? Okay. Ladies, your handhold is like this, so it's palm to palm. What we don't want to do is... We need to be quite flexible when we're doing this move, only because you don't want to break the guy's wrist when he's doing this move, okay? Okay, from here, we're feet together. I'm going to pull with the right hand, and Nikki's gonna, that's going to lead Nikki to step back on the right as I also step on my right foot. From here, I'm going to lead Nikki forwards. So forwards with the right hand. Nikki steps on her right, right foot, mm -hmm. ready to spin on the right foot. Yeah. So to spin her, we've got a little bit of almost... Tension coming up, okay? So I'm going to spin her clockwise by pulling with the right hand. Nikki's going to start turning. I'm going to raise my right hand, taking it over her head. Nikki keeps turning. <laughs> we lower and step with our partner. Okay, so from this side. Right to right. Lead your partner away with the right hand. Step to your left, creating space on your right hand side. As I pull, I raise the right hand to Nikki's now far shoulder. I pull with the right hand, step like so. So we're both stepped in line. I then lead Nikki forwards. So she's forward on her right foot, ready for the turn. Mm -hmm. Pull, raise, turn, comes round to face, and we step with our partner. Okay, from this side again, it's lead away. Raise shoulder and step. And step, turn and back. Okay, to a count. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Six beats. Let's try it from this side. Ladies, what I just want to say is when we're doing that first shoulder sway bit. So if you Jim just do this. So automatically I'm going to offer my spare hand. Okay? Because in other moves the guy can take the spare hand and then either maybe do something with that, change it into a different move. But I always offer just in case. Now at this point if he hasn't taken it then when I do the sway bit, so if he hasn't taken it by then as he does a sway bit I might sort of take my hand down because he's not touched it. Okay? I didn't offer. I did offer, and I put it oh, down. Yeah. yeah. No, okay, good. Okay, so. Right, from here, from this side, mm -hmm. to a count, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, that was it. If you enjoyed that move, yeah. please subscribe, and then you get to see all the others. Tell your friends, and we'll see you for the next time. Bye. Bye. Hi everyone, welcome to Smooth Jive, we're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the accordion. Okay, it? so this move is a right-handed move. We're going to show you what it looks like first. Seven, eight. Away, raise, collect, raise, collect, and away. Okay, so right hand to right hand. We start off in the slot, like we do normally. I'm going to lead Nikki away, as I do... I'm going to step to my left, creating space on my right hand side. Then I'm going to lead Nikki forwards with my right hand. As I do, I'm going to raise my right hand, 
we're going to go anti-clockwise for the ladies. As we do, I'm going to offer my left hand down at waist level. I'm going to step to my left with my left foot. And Nikki's back on her... Right foot. Right foot. Mm -hmm. And the reason it's called the uh, accordion is because of this shape. Mm -hmm. So my right hand is high and my left hand is low. Okay? And there's a little bit of a, a spring when we do this. Mm -hmm. Now, the next part, I actually stay where I am, which is nice and easy for me. Mm -hmm. Nikki's going to actually go to the other side of the slot. So I'm going to keep the right hand high as I raise my left hand. Okay, so ladies, what you're going to do is you end up in this position. So feet together-ish and your hands held high. So we're both feet together. As I lower my right hand, I'm going to step to my right. Okay, I twist and I just step back on my right foot. So we're now left hand high, right hand low. And then to exit the move, I pull with my right hand, raising it like so. Okay, ladies, you go back in that same position, feet together, hands held high. Now I'm going to lower my left hand, step to the left, and then into the slot as it were right to right. And I've let go with my left hand and we rotate hands and there we are. Now from this side, right to right, lead your partner away with the right hand, step out of the slot guys with your left leg. You're then going to raise the right hand as you pull your partner towards you. So raise the right hand as I step out of the slot like so, feet together at this point. I'm going to offer my left hand to Nikki's left hand. Left hand. I'm stepping to the left. Nikki's step back on the right foot. I'm right hand high, left hand low. Then we step like so, feet together, lower the right hand. Sit back on the right, ladies. Left hand high, right hand low. I've stepped to my right. To exit the move, I pull right. Turn my hand in Nikki's hand, let go with my left, step into the slot, lower, and step with my partner. So let's try that to a count. From this side, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. From this side, mm -hmm. here we go. Five. Six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Last time, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. If you that like worked. that move, please subscribe, like, share. Hit the notification bell, tell all your friends, tell your pets. They'll love it as well. <laughs> and we'll see you for the next one. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki. And we've just decided what we're going to call this move. It's the right-handed spin pass, I think. I'm not saying that. Kind of looks like this. <laughs> I will call it the move. <laughs> okay, looks like there's seven, eight, one, two, three, and four. Okay, so this is a bit unusual, this move. If you've mm. been learning with, our, with us with our other moves, okay, guys, you normally step to the left. Well, this is a weird move because we're going to step to our right. Yeah. So it's actually a right to right move. So guys right, ladies right. As I need lick, nick, licky, <laughs> Nicky away. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole other video. Yeah. No, I'm only joking. <laughs> so, uh, as I lead the... Oh, I'm done now. I know. Sorry. <laughs> okay. As we lead... We, as I lead Nikki away, I'm going to step to my right hand side. So, with my right foot, right hand uh, foot out of the slot. And I'm actually going to pivot and start facing back down the way I've just come from. So, I'm facing this way. So, I'll just do that again. Mm -hmm. Lead away and face this way. With my right hand, I lead forwards. And as Nikki steps, I start to pull, turn the hand over. Nikki spins, as she does beautifully. I step in with my left hand to right and collect. We'll do it from this side. 
So I'm going that way. So yeah. right to right, I'm going to lead away with my right hand, but I'm step to my right. This is going to throw people off. Yeah. Okay, so I'm creating space on my left hand side this time. As I do, I start to pivot. This allows me to get in a position where I can lead better. I pull forwards down the slot with my right hand, down the slot. When Nick is taking the step, I pull, spin, collect, left to right. Okay, and step with my partner. So again, from this side, right to right, lead away, step right, pull, turn, let go. Don't forget to let go. Yeah. Crack. <laughs> left to right, step in and away. Okay, from this side, right to right, and for one, away, two, pull, spin, three and four, is your step and collect. Okay, to a count. Guys right, ladies right. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, and four. From this side. I'm trying to think what I can add for the ladies there. Okay. Ah, uh, let me go through my... Okay, so as we go back, ladies, when the guy leads us forward, you are automatically going to step forward on your right foot. When he pulls you back to spin you, you should turn on your right foot, almost a one and a half, and then you're back on your right when he, when he leads you back. Okay, so it's not many steps for you, really. Okay, I'll do it to count. Yeah. Five, mm -hmm. six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four. Okay, okay. I think we got it. If you enjoyed yeah. that move, like, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you for the next lesson. Cheers, all. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive with Jim and Nikki. Did that frighten you then? No. <laughs> I thought you were waiting for me. No. Well, I'm waiting for you. <laughs> so we're going to teach you today the travelling return move. Looks okay. like this. Here we go. Travelling return. Seven, eight. Step away. Change places. And back. Mm. Nice and easy. Okay, it's a three beat move. We're going to offer our left hand to our partner. Lead our partner back. Now, as we do, I make space on my right-hand side by stepping to my left. Nicky, step back on. Right foot. I'm going to, with the travelling return. It is a travelling return. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Um, we're going to raise our left hand. So my hand is literally going to rotate in Nicky's hand, and we end up palm to palm. Nicky's going to go to the other side of the slot as I'm going to step with my right foot as Nicky starts to come through and pass me on my right hand side under my left arm. We come round to face and lower and I step with my partner. So from this side, mm -hmm. lead your partner away with the left hand. I'm stepping to my left, raising the left hand, rotating my hand in Nicky's hand. I come round using my right foot to step back into the slot, come round to face and step with your partner. Okay. Nice and easy move to a count. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three. Three boots. Boots, beats. Mm -hmm. Five, six, seven, Eight and one, two and three. Now you'll see with me to make this e e to make this move easier for me. <laughs> when I lead away, my left foot steps to the left. But what I'm going to immediately do with my right foot is, as Nikki passes, I place it into the slot behind her, pivot on it as I come round, and then step with my partner with my left foot. So. It's a one, step with my right foot in, pivot, and step forward with my left foot. So that makes it a lot easier for the guys to get round. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three. Okay, last time, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and a one, two, and three. Okay, if you enjoyed that, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you for the next lesson. Bye.
Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the catapult. And that's where I literally want to get a catapult out and fire it. <gasps> but I, last right. time I had one of them was about that high. <laughs> so uh, the catapult looks like this. Seven, eight. Away, raise, step across, prepare, spin, and step. Okay. It's a right-handed to right-handed move. So we offer our right hand to our partner's right hand. Guys, you're going to have to do a bit of stepping around mm -hmm. the slot for this move, okay? Normally, we just stay on one side of the slot. With this move, we actually go from both sides. So, and Ladies, what I'll do is, after Jim's taught the, the move, I'll go to the footwork with you. So, I'm going to lead away with my right hand, step to my left, as I do normally, creating mm -hmm. space on my right-hand side. Now, it's important that you make m as much space as you can for your partner, you're going to pull with the right hand, but raise it. Okay, so raise that right hand. That starts to turn your partner in an anti-clockwise direction. So as she starts to step backwards and past you, we step across the slot with our right foot. Okay, so it's quite a big step. But what we're trying to do then is offer our left hand behind us to our partner. So we're now double-handed. With my left foot, I step backwards, bringing my partner into my left-hand side. Now, I'll just show you. Nikki's forward on her right foot. Mm -hmm. Okay. From here, I'm going to let go with my right hand, and I want to turn Nikki in a clockwise direction in front of me. To do that, I'm going to pull with my left hand, pull it towards me, let go. Nikki's going to spin <laughs> all the way around on her, her own steam. <laughs> And then I'm going to lead, step, ready for the next move. So, okay. we'll try it from this side. So the footwork's a, a little bit more complicated on this move, mm -hmm. even though it's a beginner move, but never mm -hmm. mind. So it's right to right, lead away. I'm stepping on my left, Nikki's back on her right, as usual. I'm going to raise the right hand to start turning Nikki anti-clockwise, like so. As I start, as I lower this right hand, Nikki's going to step back. I'm stepping across the slot. So right foot, left foot comes in and back. So I'm literally taking it from there to there. So I create space on my left hand side. I've offered the spare hand. Nikki's taking it automatically. I let go with the right hand. Nikki's forward on the right foot. I'll go over the footwork in a moment, ladies. And that's the foot she's going to spin on. I'm going to make her spin, so I'm going to pull with the left hand towards me, help her spin on her axis around that foot. So pull around the foot, let go, catch left to right, and then step. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go over the footwork for you ladies. The key point for this move is to keep close and do small steps. I'll explain how it might go wrong, but let's do it right uh, for now. So as Jim leads me back, I step back on the right foot. As he starts to turn me, I turn and I step back on my right foot, so I'm facing this way. As Jim offers and does his step across the slot, I literally change weight from right foot to left foot. As he goes to turn me, or spin me, I'm going to step forward on my right foot, and that's the foot that I'm going to spin on. So as Jim spins me, feet together, and then he's going to lead me back. Okay, from this side, still. Mm -hmm. Right to right, mm -hmm. it's a one, right. two, three, four, five, and six. I do not believe that's six beats, but we'll try we'll it. We'll try anyway. it, we'll try it. <gasps> okay, six beats. It's not six beats. Here we go. <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, four, five, well, six. Six, yeah, six yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Who knew? Okay, so I just want to explain about how it might go wrong. So if you're going to do big steps, this is probably how it's going to look. So you go back. So ladies, you're going back, step. And can you see, like you're doing it wrong. You're actually doing it right. So oh. <laughs> well, years I wanted to of kind practice. of do it wrong. Years of practice dancing with women in the wrong place. <laughs> Oh, you just made it work. You, uh, 
What can I say? <laughs> you okay. ruined my take. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so... Small steps are good <laughs> steps, ladies. Small steps are always good steps yeah. in this game. So, here we go. Nice, slow count. In fact, we'll step it through because it's a tricky move, this one. So, here we go. Lead away for one. Raise for two. Threes are in. Four is back. Five is the spin. Six is the step. So, let's try it to a count. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. If you like that move, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, and share, and tell your pets. Lovely. Thank you very much. And bye. -bye. bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki. And today's lesson, no, move, is the double comb. Okay. Uh, we're going to show you what it looks like first. Now, we're going to go on the other side because it looks nicer from this side. Okay, so, right. it looks like this. Seven, eight. Away, turn, comb, comb, away. Okay. So, I'll actually teach it from this side for a change to start with. It's a right hand to right hand move. So, we're going to lead our partner away with the left hand. The right hand, the one we just offered. Okay. We're going to lead our partner away with the right hand. We're going to do a traveling return with the right hand. So we raise the right hand. I've stepped out of the slot. Nikki starts to pass me on my right hand side. As she does, I'm going to offer my left hand at waist level like so and come round to face. So I'm currently right hand high, left hand at waist level. Now, as we do, I'm actually going to come round to face the camera, taking my right hand over my head and onto my shoulder. Then I take my left hand up and over Nikki's head onto her far shoulder. I let go with my right hand. Nikki then steps back as we face each other and I step ready for the next move. So and from this side. But you've transferred your hands. And transferred. I'm left yeah. to right at the, at the end. So we're going to again start again. So right to right. right. Lead your partner away. So I'm stepping out with my left foot. Nikki's back on her right. Yeah. I'm raising my right hand to do a traveling return with the right hand. So raise the right hand. Nikki's turning anti-clockwise. I'm going to step into the slot with my right foot, offering my left hand to Nikki's left. I knew that. I Good. Think about that. So I'm going to turn. <laughs> I'm going to turn clockwise to come around to face, but I keep turning clockwise under my right arm. So I'm keep turning, keep turning, comb my hair with my right hand, letting go. Take my left hand over Nikki's head onto the far shoulder. Then we move away from each other like so, and we end up left to right. Okay, from this side again. Here we go. Lead, it's right to right. Lead away with the right hand. Traveling return, so raise that right hand. Get ready to offer the left hand to left. Come round to face, but keep turning in a clockwise direction. Comb, comb, shimmy away, like so, and you're left to right. Good. Let's try that to a count from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, Eight and one, two, three, four, five. From this side, mm -hmm. five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, mm -hmm. and five. Now, nice. chaps, you'll notice when I do this move, I lead away, I'm stepping in with the right foot, and now my whole turn happens on my right foot. So I'm literally going to step in, turn all the way around to face, and comb. Okay, so it's nice and easy as we step away. Good. Last time, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five. Fantastic. If you like that move, please like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you for the next lesson.
Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. Uh, we're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to be teaching you the Neck Break 360. Okay, looks like this. We always demo it first. Seven, eight, and away. Hand to shoulder, collect, and around we go for the 360, and raise, and back. Okay, teach from this side first. So it's a left to right hand move. We start off in the slot. I'm going to lead Nikki away. As I step to the left on my left foot, Nikki's back on her right foot. So from here, I'm going to lead Nikki towards me. I'm going to take my right foot out of the way, out of the slot. Nikki steps forward. I start raising the left hand because I want Nikki to turn clockwise. As she does, as she turns clockwise, my right hand goes to the far shoulder and I swap Nikki's hand from my left to my right and place it on the shoulder. So now my left hand is going to take Nikki's spare hand, like so. And actually, I'm going to go, rather than palm to palm, I'm going to go, no, I am going to go palm yeah. to palm. I've changed my mind. I'm going to go palm to palm. Okay, from here, I'm going to step Nikki forward, but it's important that I keep this left hand low and down by my left leg, okay? Because I don't want Nikki to start going back down the slot. So as Nikki steps forward, she'll want to go down the slot. What we do is we keep the right hand high, palm to palm. I'm going to rotate this hand, go palm to palm with my left hand. Keep this low and near your leg. Then I step round Nikki as she stays in the slot. As I do, I take my right hand over my head. As I get to this position, I start to lower the right hand and raise the left. I step out the slot with my left foot. With the right hand low and the left hand high, I pull with the right hand to turn Nikki anti-clockwise all the way round until we're side by side. Okay, my right hand's on Nikki's far hip, left hand is still currently high. And then, as I lead Nikki away, I'm going to nudge with my right forearm, let go with my left, and then as she starts to face and come round to face, I then raise my right hand to turn Nikki fully clockwise, round to face, feet together, then we lower and step with our partner. Let's try it from this side. Okay, guys left, ladies right. Lead away, step out of the slot. Right hand starts to go high. Lead your partner forwards. Right hand goes to the far shoulder. As we turn Nikki out in a clockwise direction, my right hand swaps hands with my left. So I swap, go palm to palm. Left hand goes palm to palm here, or on top. Getting ready to go fingers under. Step Nikki forwards. You have to keep this left hand close to your body because it stops your partner going down the slot. I then step round my partner, taking my right hand over my head. When I come round to this part of this slot, I've gone over my head with my right hand. I start raising the left, stepping across the slot. Left hand goes over my head. So now both my hands are to my right hand side. I lower the right, turning Nikki anti-clockwise to this point, collect, lower the left let go. Nudge your partner forward with your forearm when she comes round to face. Raise the right hand, turn, lower and back. Okay. Ladies, I'll try and tell you what I'm doing. Not quite sure okay. there's any real... We'll do, we'll do it from this side then. <laughs> any real footwork, but I'll, I'll give it a go. So, as Jim leads me back, pulls me into the neck break position. Okay, I would always offer my left hand and it's up to him whether he takes it or not. So as Jim starts to turn me, I'm literally standing in the spot, uh, slop, sorry, and as I'd, I'm just literally almost following him around. <laughs> very, very small steps. I'm not pulling with the arms or anything. He's doing all the work. I'm literally just taking very small steps around, not spinning on the spot, just doing a few little steps. Great. Let's try it from this side. Okay, we lead away, collect to the shoulder, like so. Then as Nikki steps, again, I almost pull down on this left hand, round my head, 
over with my left hand over my head, turn and lead away with a turn Ten. and step back. Okay, let's try it to a count. I just almost forgot the other bit there. Nikki just reminded me. So here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's try it from this side. Ten beats. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Unbelievable. Yay. Ten beats every time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, we're going to link that move into a routine, routine number eight. So stick around for that, and we'll see you next time. Thanks all. Bye. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to be teaching you the sway shoulder spin. Okay, it normally looks like this. Seven, eight, away, in, shoulder, turn, and right. Okay, we'll teach from this side. Mm -hmm. So it's a, a right-handed move for the sway. I'm going to lead Nikki away. So as I do, I'm going to step out to the slot with my left foot. Nikki's back on the right foot, mm -hmm. and I've created mm -hmm. space on my right-hand side. Now, the sway involves rotating the hand, so Nikki's hand, yeah. over and leading her towards me as I take this hand, my right hand onto Nikki's far hip, okay? And feet together at this point, mm -hmm. okay? Now, um, I would normally offer my spare hand at this point, but we're not gonna do that. We're next gonna step back on the right foot, both of us. So I lead Nikki back. We both step back on the right foot, and then I take my left hand to Nikki's far shoulder here. Now. There's a tendency, you have to take it wide mm -hmm. so you don't go and hit your partner in the <laughs> face as you come across, okay? So, left hand, Nikki's... Right shoulder. Right shoulder. So, my left hand, Nikki's mm -hmm. right shoulder. From here, I'm going to let go with my right hand, lead Nikki back down the slot by pulling with my left hand and turning Nikki anti-clockwise, one and a half turns, and then I offer the right hand and step with Nikki that move okay. let's teach it from this side mm -hmm. so we're right to right lead your partner away lead step to your left with your left foot nikki's back on her right foot yeah. mm -hmm. wrap in feet together at this point not going to offer the spare hand pull back with the right hand as we both step with our right foot and back i take my left hand across and place it on Nikki's far shoulder, and you can see my fingers are over. Let go with the right hand, gonna take it, turn Nikki one and a half turns, turns anti-clockwise, catch right to right, and step back. Let's try it to a count. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. Six beats, we think. Yeah. Let's try it from this side. Okay. Right to right. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four, five, and six. Fantastic. So, if for the ladies, when Jim's spinning me out, so I've been getting to the um, spinny position. There we go. Uh, so when he spins me out, I'm not actually turning on the spot. I'm actually walking as I'm turning. So I'll just show you. I'm kind of just stepping and turning. And then obviously it's going to come to the end and you're going to step back on the right and he's going to uh, grab your right hand. Okay? And clearly, as leads, we need to stay next to our yeah. partner. So obviously, if I spin Nikki and I stay here and she's over there, the next move is going to be really hard to do. It will be, okay. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, one more time. Here we go. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight, 
seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, if you enjoyed that move, please like, subscribe, and share, and we'll see you for the next lesson. Cheers all. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to be teaching you the... First move, shoulder spin. First move, shoulder spin. <laughs> That's the one. <laughs> okay. Okay, looks like this. Seven, eight, and away. Shoulder, spin, collect, right to right. Okay, move goes like this. Left hand to your partner's right hand, facing each other. I'm going to step to my left out of the slot as I lead away with my left hand, creating space on my right hand side. And then, totally forgot. More. Oh, yes, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm going to lead my partner to the other end of the slot. But as I do, left hand comes up round about my left shoulder. Right hand goes on Nick on top of Nikki's far shoulder. So her... My left shoulder. Nikki's left shoulder. Far shoulder. And my... My hand cups over the top because I'm going to pull this, use my left hand and my right hand to spin Nikki in a clockwise direction. As I do, I let go with that left hand. Nikki keeps turning. I, then my right hand is already here. So I'm literally going to step into the slot, offer my right hand and step in. It's a fairly fast move. This side. So guys left, ladies right. Lead away. I step to my left, creating space on my right. Left hand comes up round about shoulder height. Right hand goes on Nikki's far shoulder. I pull with my right, spin Nikki round. My right hand's already ready, and I step in, and we're right to right. So, Nikki, going to take you through the footwork, ladies. Can we just do it, and then I'll know what I'm doing? Is that, that would help, <laughs> okay. actually. Okay, seven, <laughs> eight, one, two, three, and... Cool. Right, okay. I've realised what I'm doing now. Okay, so ladies, what I'm doing is I'm travelling across to the other side of the slot. I'm not doing a spin on one foot. I'm actually sort of stepping on my tippy toes around. If we try and do it a little bit slowly, okay. So I go back, I go step, I'm turning, 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 and then I'm back on the right foot. Okay? So there's only a few steps, but I'm not actually doing, if we can do it wrong, this is what you don't want to do. So you want to don't want to do, and then go back. Yeah. So you're turning quite on the spot, but you're, it's like turny, 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 and then back. Our job uh, as a lead is if our partner does wander off and starts mm. heading towards the bar or whatever, but we stay close to our partner. So if we do this, and she starts to spin away, you just keep close to your partner as, as you can. Okay. However, we want to sort of be... Here-ish. Mm. Okay. To account from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four. From this side. Left to right. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four. We bumped into each other when we did that. <laughs> Hopefully no one noticed. Five, <sighs> six, Seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four. Just quickly on my footwork for the chaps, I'm actually doing a pivot there. So I lead away, collect. My right foot is coming round like so. I'm going to pivot, ready to step forward on my left foot. So a little pivot on my feet helps me get around much more quickly. Okay, last time. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, and five, four. Right hand to right hand. I That's picked up with the wrong hand. <laughs> okay, if you like that move, <laughs> remember to like, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you for the next lesson. Thanks all. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the penguin. Okay, penguin uh, looks like this. So we normally do a demo. Here we go, seven, eight, away, collect, or one, two, three, four, and five. Nice and easy? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll teach from this side as usual. It's a left hand to right hand move, so my left, Nikki's right. 
lead your partner away. Now, I'm stepping out of the slot on my left foot. Right foot is staying in the slot, but I'm creating space on my right hand side. Nikki step back on her right foot. I'm going to bring it, Nikki in towards me down the slot by pulling with my left hand. My right hand goes out and will collect Nikki's far shoulder. And as we do, it's very important that we go, as I start to turn Nikki out, like so, in a clockwise direction, we go knee to knee. Okay, so it's very important our knees are touching and overlapping. Okay, so you're not literally hitting knee to knee, you're actually overlapping your knees and touching them. Then what we do with my right foot and Nikki's right foot close together is we step round. So we go weight on the left foot, back on the right, but our knees are still overlapping and still touching. Round, round, round. And then I send Nikki down the slot the way she was going by letting go with my right hand leading away with my left and Nikki steps back on the right foot on the right foot so let's try it from this side left to right lead your partner away we collect so the right hand goes to the far shoulder I bring Nikki towards me this is where our knees overlap then we start stepping round in a circle clockwise like so step 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 and when you're on the left foot, lead your partner away down the slot, and that's the end of the move. Now, the overlapping of the knee is crucial to the move. So if Nikki, you just put your knee forward, mm -hmm. I will put my knee here and overlap. Okay? So you can see that it's not, not, it's not that, Ooh. okay, because that would be painful, <laughs> but they overlap. So we'll just turn around this side. Overlap like so. So you can see from both sides. Then the frame will do the rest of the work. So as long as our knees are touching, yeah. we can both step as many times as we want like so. Now, the reason the move's called the penguin is if you do it badly, yeah. okay, <laughs> it will start to look like this. Okay? Like penguins. Okay? So as much as the move's called the penguin, yeah. that's what we don't want. So here we go. From this side, we lead away. We collect, as we collect, even if Nikki's not that close, I step in with my right foot and get the, the knees overlapping, and then we go round, like so, lower and away. So the number of steps we take are lead away, collect, and then it's a one, two, three, four, Oh, that didn't feel six. right. Six. <laughs> Maybe six. We'll try it to a beat anyway. Here that we go. That help. To a count. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, and back. Yeah. That, that seemed right. You didn't like that at all. Let's try it again. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, and... Three and four and five and back. Yeah. Yes. I think that is right. We yeah. got it. Okay. Yeah. If you enjoyed that move, we're <laughs> going to link it into a routine. Mm -hmm. Routine eight, actually. So stay around for that move and we'll see you next time. Thanks all. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki. And today we're going to teach you the sway step with a lean. Okay. It looks like this. It's so a right to right move. We're just going to demo it first. So here we go. Seven, eight, and away. Collect. One, two, three, four, back, two, three, and return and back. Okay. Let's teach the move. It's a right to right move. So guys, you offer your right hand to your partner's right. I'm going to lead our partner away. Now, I normally would step out the slot. I'm not going to this time. I'm just going to lead my partner away. So I'm in the slot. So she knows she's not going over there. Okay. Now, the sway would normally be to my right hand side. But what I'm going to do is rotate Nikki's hand over gently. So I turn it clockwise. Yes, clockwise. Mm -hmm. Wrap Nikki into my front. So Nikki comes in feet together. I collect the spare hand with my right hand. And my right hand stays on the hip. 
Now at this point, my chest touches Nikki's back, so we have contact. And then with the weight on my left foot and Nikki's left foot, yeah. we then step to our right, our left, our right, our left, our right, and go back on the left foot like so. So my left foot goes back, as does Nikki's, and raise the left hand like so. Now I'm not going to let go of Nikki. Please don't. But she's very gently <laughs> on me, on my right leg. Okay, from here. I let go with the left hand, start to raise the right hand, turning Nikki clockwise, one and a half turns, lower and step back. Let's try it from this side. So it's right to right. Lead your partner away. So Nikki's back on the right foot. Wrap her in and collect. Take the spare hand and we go a one, two, three, Four is on the right foot. I step back on my left. My right leg acts as support. Left hand comes up. We do a little pose. Hold for about three. Then take the left hand down, letting go. Nikki then starts to turn clockwise. One and a half turns, raising the right hand. Comes round to face, lower, and step with. Okay. Now, the step, we're going to do it from this side. So I'm going to do the move from this side. I'm going to stand near the wall so you get to see what it looks like. Away, collect, and one, two, three, four, pose. And then up with the turn. Okay, and I'm going to do it from this side. So again, you can get to see it. Here we go. Away, collect, and one, two, three, four, pose, and raise, and with. Okay, so you've seen it from all angles. Let's try it to a nice little count. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, Four, five, six, and seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Again from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 and 12. Okay, from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and 12. Okay, lovely. Hey. If you like that move, we're going to add it to routine eight. eight. So stick around for routine eight, and then you can be able to join three moves into a routine. Um, and if you liked it, hit like, subscribe, and share, and we'll see you for the next one. Cheers all. Bye-bye. Bye. Hello again. Welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki. And today's move is the first move, lean, with a block turn exit. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I'm trying to be very specific and detailed so everybody knows what we're learning today. I'll tell you now, guys, I never remember names of names. No, so no. I've already forgotten what she said. I know. I know. So, okay. I do know what the move is, though. <laughs> okay. Looks like this. Seven, eight, and away, and step, pose, up, block, turn, and with. Okay. Oh. So, guys left, ladies right. We're going to lead our partners away with the left hand. As we do, guys, you're going to step left with your left foot, creating space on your right hand side, like so. So I'm bringing my feet together as I bring Nikki forwards and down the slot. I'm keeping my left hand low, okay? Left hand low, right hand goes under Nikki's far shoulder blade as I turn her out and she steps back on her right, right foot. foot. Yep. I come round to face like so. 
and stepping, I'm not stepping onto my left foot, my weight's on my right foot. Now, at this point, I'm actually going to say to Nikki, because she knew what the move was, so I didn't have to say it, feet together. Yeah. Okay, now this is very important. I'm going to bring my left hand up to my left shoulder height. Nikki must be feet together. That's very important. Mm -hmm. What I then do is bring my right foot in and touch Nikki's feet. Okay, her right foot. Her right foot. So my right foot to her right foot, they're actually touching. I've got my right hand on her far shoulder, left hand in this position, and we're side by side. Hip okay? to hip ish. Hip to hip. Now, just to, I'm going to turn just to show you. Okay, so Nikki is not in front of me, she's literally on my side. So in this position, I'm going to go palm to palm, or Nikki's going to grab I'm onto gonna, my yeah, shoulder, will, like yeah. so, onto my shoulder. And we just, when we first start doing this move, I'm supporting Nikki here. And we just do a slight lean, okay? Now, you'll notice my core is vertical, okay? I'm just slightly stepping out on my, my left foot. My weight's on my left foot, okay? And my body acts as, as a support for Nikki. Okay, back up. Let's let go and actually start from this side. Left to right. So, lead your partner away. Step to the left with the left foot. Nikki's back on her right. Left hand, left shoulder, as I collect with my right hand to turn Nikki out in a clockwise direction, she's back on her right foot. At this point, I say feet together. Mm -hmm. When her feet come together, I can then move my right foot in to connect with my right foot to right foot. Mm -hmm. Collect over the shoulder, like so. Hip to hip. My left leg needs to be parallel with my right leg. My right hand is on Nikki's far shoulder blade. And then a slight lean like so. Now, when you start to get the hang of this move, guys can act embellishment. Now, you'll notice that my left arm is matching Nikki's left arm in a diagonal. So we could do this. Well, that looks wicked. And I think that looks very nice. Um, <laughs> so, ladies, a bit of styling for you. So can you just get me up again? Okay. So when we're in this position and he's going to lean... <laughs> If it's your first time, you might go, ah, <laughs> start screaming. What we don't want to see is this. Okay, that does not look very nice at all. <laughs> For obvious reasons, what you want to do is literally just point your left toe very nicely, and then you can do things with your arms. You can look down. You could even hold on still if you want to. It's up to you. Okay. From here, feet together. I'm going to pull with my right hand to start turning Nikki in a clockwise direction. Now, my right arm will want to come out of, of that hold. But what I do is, I, as I turn my right hand anti-clockwise, and I'm going to, going to collect Nikki's left arm from here and block her from turning clockwise. Okay, so she, she was going to turn clockwise. Yeah, I'm blocked. I hold with my right hand pull back to spin her anti-clockwise, full turn, like so. Yep. I collect left to right and then step with my partner. So from this side, lead away. I step to my left, Nikki's back on her right foot. Create space on the right-hand side and collect. Turn your partner out. I just pivot on my right foot, feet together. Mm -hmm. So I step left. Right foot goes in, hips, hold, lean, up. I pull with my right hand to turn Nikki clockwise, but then use my right hand to block, pull, spin anti-clockwise, catch left to right, and step with from this side. Lead away. Collect. Twist out. Feet together. I go, I go on my left foot, feet together, hip to hip, and pose, up, pull with the right hand, block, spin, collect left to right. From this side to a count, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Let's try it from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Did we, Fantastic. Was it nine beats before? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, nine beats. Okay. Just to be sure, we'll do it one more time <laughs> from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't know where I'm going there. <laughs> yeah, a little bit off to the uh, left there, but it all worked. Anyway, if you like that move, don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And we'll see you for the next lesson. Cheers all. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki, And today we're going to teach you the accordion lean. So we normally start by showing you what it looks like. So it looks like this, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay, so right hand to right hand move. So right hand for the guys, right hand for the ladies. We're gonna lead our partner away. I'm gonna step to the left on my left foot, like so, creating space on my right hand side. Nikki's back on her- My right foot. I'm going to raise the right hand as I pull and raise. At this point, we go feet together. I'm then going to step to my left with my left foot, offering my left hand to Nikki's... Left hand. Left hand, as she steps back... On my on, right foot. On her right foot. So this is the first part of the accordion. I'm right hand high, left hand low. I'm going to pull with the left hand, raise it. We come feet together. Lower the right hand, I step to my right. And I step back on my right foot, ladies. Now this is the hook. So I'm going to pull with my right hand, letting go, and my right arm goes in to Nikki's left. No, that's right. your right arm. Yep. <laughs> your right arm. And I collect like so. Now I'm going to show you what this looks like. So you stay where you are. We're side by side at the moment. My right hand is hooked under, and this right, the back of my right hand goes against Nikki's back. My left hand is high. Now, at this point... I'll show you, ladies, what I'm doing. I'm, I'm clamping onto Jim's right shoulder, so I'm doing this. Okay? Okay, at this point, what happens is I come behind Nikki as best I can, okay, and take a step with my left foot out and just take Nikki off balance. That's all, lowering the left hand. So just off balance. I can almost let go of Nikki, but she's leaning on me a little bit. <laughs> yeah. I come up, raising that left hand, let, lower the right hand, let go with the left, and we face each other. Okay, from this side. Mm -hmm. Right to right, lead away for the accordion. Raise that right hand. Feet together at this point. Step, I step left. Nikki steps back on the right foot. We raise both hands. I then, from feet together, I step to my right. This is the hook. So I pull with the right hand. Left hand stays high. My right hand goes in and immediately goes to here. Now, what I can't do is lean Nikki from this position. Mm -mm. Okay, it's really, she'll just hit the deck, to be honest. What I do is I step forwards with my right foot into the slot and come round. Literally, Nikki then leans on my body as I take my left leg out for support, lower, and Nikki's on my body. So if I let go of my arms, you can see Nikki's on me and fully supported. Mm -hmm. Okay? From here, raise the left hand. The right hand slips away and we collect and I let go with my left and we're right to right where we finished. So to a count, looks like this. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, again from this side. Five, 
six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Now that hook, oops, so we'll let go of my hands. <laughs> now that hook and the, the support takes a little bit of practice. Mm -hmm. So if you're going to do this in freestyle, make sure you've really got the hang of it. Okay. Now, just show you the harder way to do this move is if I go perpendicular to Nikki, so I'm not actually behind her. Mm -hmm. I'm sideways on. I can do this move. Now I can do it because I can actually let go, and Nikki actually has her own weight. I do. Okay, so it looks more than it is. Yeah. Okay, however, in freestyle, quite often women go much further and I'm like, hmm, okay, <laughs> I've got you back where I want you up here. <laughs> so I've learnt over time in freestyle, when I do this move is to hook, pivot, and immediately my chest goes into the shoulders mm -hmm. and I can take any weight that's thrown at me. Give Thanks. or take. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and away. Okay. <laughs> if you like that move, please subscribe, like, sh and share, and we'll see you for the next move. Cheers, all. <laughs> bye bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the basket comb with a block and a turn. He's got to write all this into the description, so I'll make it as hard as possible. <laughs> it's the basket comb. It's really short. Okay. As usual, we'll show you what the move looks like. Okay. But I like this move. Mm. It's nice. Okay. Looks like this. Seven, eight. Offer, wrap, comb, turn, block, travel through, and back. Okay. Yes. I do enjoy that move, actually. Yeah. It's nice. It works. Nice. <laughs> Okay, it's a left to right hand to start with. So we were guys left, ladies right. Lead your partner away. As you do, you're going to offer that spare hand and your partner takes it. So we're now double handed. I've created space on my right hand side. Nikki's back on her right foot. I'm going to wrap Nikki in for a basket. Again, if, if you want to know how the basket's done, check up there. I'll link to it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wrap Nikki into my right hand side. So I raise my left hand. My hand turns in Nikki's hand. So we end up palm to palm with the left hand. Wrapping Nikki in. Nikki's turning anti clockwise. We're both feet together at this point. As I lower my left hand, I pull with my right. So we both step right on our right foot, lowering the spare hand. What about the comb? I forgot the comb. Okay. Okay, from here. Left hand comes over the head, like so. A bit quicker than that normally. Mm -hmm. Okay, from here, we're going to lead our partner forward. So she's going to step forward on her right, right. foot. Yeah. So Nikki's forward on her right foot. I'm still holding with both hands. And then going to nudge with my right forearm as Nikki starts to turn clockwise. As I do, I raise the left hand. Nikki turns fully clockwise. The right hand starts to go behind Nikki's back like so in a, what's called a half Nelson. I've still got hold with the left hand. Nikki comes all around Ray Wayne to <laughs> all the way around to face. We go palm to palm with the left hand and that goes to shoulder height. Stay where you are. We're just going to show you what Nikki's back looks like. Okay. So my right hand is still here and we're palm to palm, palm to palm. I need to go back, I think. So you do. You need to go back this way. Okay. No, I need to step back. Oh, there we and go. step back. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so Nikki's yeah. back on the right yeah. foot. From here, I'm going to pull with the right hand to start turning Nikki anti-clockwise. So that sets Nikki in motion. At this point, I let go with the right hand, keep the left hand high to keep Nikki turning anti-clockwise, comes around to face, lower, and step with your partner. Okay. Ooh, that's a long move, actually. It is, okay, yeah. here we go. From this side, guys left, ladies right. Lead away, step to the left, offering that spare hand. Wrap your partner into your right hand side. So you raise that left hand going palm to palm. Nikki's going to turn anti clockwise, feet together at this point. 
I'm keeping this hand high because I'm going to comb with the left hand as we both step to the right. So you'll notice I'm combing with the left hand at this point. I'll just bring myself into proper position. So you now can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> so we then, Nikki's going to step forward on her right foot. So I still have hold of both hands and we're palm to palm. I'm then going to raise the left hand, nudging with my forearm. Nikki's going to do a full turn clockwise. We end up in the half Nelson with the right hand. Left hand goes to the shoulder and we step with our partner. Nikki's back on her right foot. I then pull with the right hand, making sure she's got space on my right hand side. Raising that left. Nikki's turning anti-clockwise. I let go with the right. Another turn with the left hand. Lower and step with your partner. Okay. And return. Are you sure there's a return at the end of that? I don't know. I don't think there is. Maybe I've just added We've just one added yet. a return, but that's no, it's free of charge. Don't, you know, <laughs> don't get your wallet out. It's okay. It's good. Okay. I think I was wrong. Did I just admit I was wrong on tape? <laughs> okay. Rick I'm going to play this back and forth. Victory lap. All the time. Over. You're okay. done. <laughs> one more walk through. In fact, we'll do it from this side. Mm -hmm. Do it from this side. Here we go. Lead away. Create space on the right. Wrap in. Hand stays high. As you step right, you comb. Okay, like so. I'm just going to stand properly. Step. Raise the left. Turn and block. Pull with that right hand. Double turn. One, two, and back. No return. Yes. Okay. The whole thing <laughs> to account. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nine beats. Yeah, that works. Okay. I think comb was on. I've no idea what the comb was on. I'll shout it out. Here we go. Five, six, seven, Eight and one, two, comb three, three, four, five, block six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay, last time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and nine yay love it okay if you like that move you know what to do tell all your friends that's it don't do any of the other stuff just tell your friends okay lovely thank you and bye, -bye. bye. Hi, welcome to smooth jive we're jim and nikki and today we're going to be teaching you the basket sway sling shot okay i think yes <laughs> yes <laughs> Okay, it's a <laughs> left hand to right hand move. So guys, you're going to offer your left hand to your partner's mm -hmm. right. We're going to lead our partner away and immediately pick up with the right hand so it becomes a double handed move. So we've taken hold with both hands. I've stepped to my left. Nikki's back. On my right foot. On the right foot. We're going to wrap our partner into our right hand side. To do this, we keep the right hand low. Left hand rotates in your partner's hand. You take it high, you end up palm to palm as she steps in, feet together. So I'm feet together, Nikki's feet together. Now you stay where you are, we'll just turn and show you what we look like. So we're like this at the moment, left hand is high, right hand is down at hip level and feet together. From here, we both step back on our right foot as we do a little step and we lower the left hand so both hands are down at waist level. In the cuddle position. In the cuddle position. Yeah. From here, we're going to slingshot. So I'm going to let go with my right hand. So right hand is free. But I'm going to use my forearm just to start leading Nikki back down the slot. With my left hand, I bring Nikki round to face and lead her away down the slot. Okay, we'll try it from this side. So guys left, ladies right. 
Left hand, lead, step to the left. Nikki's back on her right. Offer that spare hand. Wrap your partner in by raising the left hand, rotating in the hand to collect, feet together. We then, as we lower the left hand, step to the right. So we both step on our right foot. Hands are down at waist level. We then let go with the right hand, but we use our forearm just to lead our partner down the slot. And then we step with our partner back into the slot. So from this side again. I'll go over the footwork for the ladies, if that helps. Okay. I'm leading the way. Back on the right foot. Collect. Okay, feet together, ladies. Step. Step back on the right foot. Slingshot. So ladies, I'm going to do a right, left, and then as I'm led back, I go back on the right foot. So it's right, left, right. Okay. Let's try it to a nice slow count from this side. Five, six, seven, eight. And collect, wrap, step, slingshot. Right, left, right. Away. Okay, again. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three. Four and five. Again, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five. Now you may have noticed, chaps, mm -hmm. when I do this move, if I'm out of position, so if I've stepped too far this way, as Nikki goes to this position, she's going to want to step right, but I am miles away from doing a, a right step. So what I actually do is I cheat. I just go dum 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 and, and step. So I'll show you what that looks like. Dum and cross, cross my feet very quickly just to make sure that I'm actually behind Nikki when we do that move. Otherwise, it's going to look very odd. And we're none the wiser. Okay, from this side to a count. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five. Done. Well done. If you enjoyed that, like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you for the next lesson. Cheers all. Hi, we're Jim and Nikki. Welcome to Smooth Jive. And today we're going to teach you the first move, Wurlitzer. Okay, so we normally show you what this looks like, so we're, we will. We'll show you what it looks like. <laughs> looks like this. Seven, eight. Away, step, block, spin, and step. Okay, so nice easy move, this one. Okay, it's so a left to right move. So leads left, followers right. Mm -hmm. We're going to lead our partner away down the slot. As chaps, you take a step to your left with your left foot, creating space on your right-hand side. Then you want to bring your partner across the slot in front of you. And as you do, prepare the hand like so, the left hand at waist level, because you're going to pull back on this in a second to turn your partner in a clockwise direction. So we pull with this hand. Nikki's forward on her right foot. Right foot. So she, that's the one she's going to start uh -huh. to turn on. We turn, but as we do and let go of the left hand, our right hand goes in and blocks here. So it's on the inside arm of your partner and you block your partner from turning any further clockwise. Nikki's now going to spin on her left foot. So it's already prepared, ladies. So as I pull back on this hand, I'm going to turn Nikki anti-clockwise now. So I pull back. Nikki does a full turn. Beautifully. I catch left to right and then lead Nikki away as we both step together. So. Okay. We'll try it from this side. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Left to right-handed. So I'm going to step to my left with my left foot. Nikki's back on her right, right foot. foot. Mm -hmm. I'm then going to take my foot out of the way, pivot, using my left hand. I'm going to take it down at waist level. So Nikki's now stepped forward on her right foot, as you can see. Okay, I'm going to pull mm. back, letting go with my left hand. It's going to turn Nikki clockwise on the spot. But as I do, I'm going to get ready with my right hand to step in, block with the right hand to stop Nikki turning any further. 
There's a little bit of spring here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pull back on this right hand as Nikki spins on her left foot. Full turn. Catch left to right and step. Okay. I've got a question. I think the ladies might ask this. So, let's do the move. So, I'm just thinking, what if the ladies don't offer their hands and they're like this? What would you do? I'd just wave. <laughs> bye bye. I'm carrying on. No, that's perfectly fine. So okay. what would happen there is if in freestyle, if for whatever reason the lady does this and spins, yes. <laughs> this is what I would do. So hand is ready, spin, catch left to right. Yeah. So it would still work, mm -hmm. but you just wouldn't get the counter spin, which is what we're trying to aim for. So whole thing to account. In fact, let's walk it through one more time. Mm -hmm. Lead away, prepare, spin and block, spin, catch left to right and step. Okay, okay. to account from this side. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, five beats from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, I can't help myself, but there's a little bit of a flourish you can put mm -hmm. on this move, chaps. So I'll show you what it looks like. As I do the counter spin on Nikki with the right hand, I'm going to spin myself. Okay, so here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so I'll show you how I did that. Lead away with the left hand. Get your partner ready to turn clockwise. As you do, pull back with the left hand, letting go as you did before. Now, with the right hand blocked, you have to be forward on the ball of your right foot. So as you spin, she spins. Or well, she spins, you spin. <laughs> okay, so I spin myself clockwise. Nick is spinning anti-clockwise. Anti -clockwise, yeah. So we spin and then collect and away. So last time to account, here we go. With the flourish. With the flourish, why not? Yeah. You don't have to do the flourish, but if you want to do the flourish, you can. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Two, three, four, and five. <laughs> that was rather close, that end. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you like that move, please, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, share, tell all your friends, and tell your pets you know this. Hoorah. Cheers all. Bye-bye. <laughs> so I did that. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to be teaching you the first move block. Okay, uh, we've, it's, we've taught the first move before, so hopefully uh, you've studied that move. If not, we're going to take it slow anyway. First move block is a first move with a block. It looks like this. Seven, eight, and away. Collect and block for one and back. Block for two and back and slingshot away. Okay. Guys left, ladies right, waist level. We're going to lead our partner away. Guys, you're going to step to your left as you create space on your right-hand side. Nikki's back on her. Right foot. As we do, I'm going to take my right hand under Nikki's arm. So my right hand under Nikki's arm and collect on the far shoulder blade. Left hand goes to shoulder. And I'm going to go at this point, palm to palm. Okay, we'll stay where you are. Looks like this, palm to palm at this point. Right hand on the shoulder. Okay, you don't want it down here. On the shoulder where you get a much better lead. Okay, from here, I'm gonna pivot Nikki back on her outside foot, which is her- Right foot. So as she pivots back and steps back on her right foot, I'm gonna pivot on my right foot to face you and put my left foot out so I've got a nice strong core here, I'm in balance. And then when Nikki steps forward on her- Right foot. I can block with my left hand and my body, okay? 
and we can step like so. So ladies, what you need to do is to have some tension in that right arm. What we don't want is the floppy arm. Okay, so there needs to be some tension, so you're feeling that push and the pull when you're in the block. And for the lead guys, my left arm, which is uh, tensed, acts as a block. And when Nikki steps back, my right arm acts as a block. So my right mm -hmm. hand is pressing into Nikki's shoulder blade at this point, pulling forward. And I'm exaggerating, block. ladies, but there's a, a push and a pull action going on yeah, there. Yeah, so it feels elastic, yeah. okay, but uh -huh. nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, when Nikki's in the back position, and we've done this a thousand times, we lower with the left hand, slingshot, so we bring Nikki round to face as she steps in, we lower, let go with the right hand and just step in with the left foot as Nikki steps back. Let's try it from this side. So the chaps will be able to see us now. Mm -hmm. Okay, left to right, we lead away with the left hand, step into the left. Right hand goes under the arm as we collect. We go palm to palm with the left hand, right hand on the shoulder blade, I'm going to pivot Nikki round. She stepped back on the right foot. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pivot on my right foot. Left foot goes here. And then I bring Nikki forward on her right foot. Block. Back. So that's the first step. Second step. And back. And then we slingshot out. So I'm bringing my left foot in. Nikki comes round to face. Left hand, left hip. Lead away and step in. Okay, again from this side. Lead away, create space. Collect under the arm, pivot and hold. One block and two block and hip and away. Let's try it to a count. I just want to say, ladies, that when you're in the block position, okay, so obviously I'm just doing the very basic, just to show you that there's a push and a pull action and you're being stopped. You can do all sorts of decoration flourishes if you like, lots of hip wiggling and so on. So have a little play when you're there, but I'll just show you the basic, basic moves. Okay. okay. To a count from this side, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, and nine. Again, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Let's try it from the other side. Here we go to a count and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay, if you enjoyed Yay. that move, we'll stick it into a routine, okay, mm -hmm. which you should be able to see next. So if you like, subscribe and share, we'd appreciate it. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you the Catapult Manhattan with a twist. That's what she thinks. <laughs> so, okay, we always demo it first. So hopefully it looks like this. Seven, eight. Away, raise, over, and Manhattan. Two, three, and in. Twist, hold, two, three, and wrap. Turn, and back. Okay. There's quite a bit going on with that move. It's a long okay. move. <laughs> so, uh, not quite a beginner move, clearly. No. So, uh, a little bit more advanced. Yeah. But we'll take you through it like you're a beginner. So, anybody can do it, okay? So, it's a right-to-right -right move. And for those that want to know the catapult, uh, please see our earlier moves uh, we'll where we've up. taught the catapult. Mm -hmm. So, we lead away with the right hand. I'm creating space on my right-hand side as I step to the left with my left foot. Nikki's back on her right foot. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pull and raise with the right hand to start the catapult. I'm turning Nikki anti-clockwise. So at this point, Nikki stepped across, and I'm about to step back into the slot with my right foot. 
Now, this is where it varies from the normal catapult. Mm -hmm. You would normally lower this right hand. Do not lower the right hand, okay? Because it makes the move a lot harder. So we keep this hand high. I'm putting my weight on my right foot and I've gone palm to palm with my right hand. Palm to palm. I put my weight on my right foot, transfer my left foot behind me and start to take it out of the slot as I offer my left hand to Nikki's hand. So Nikki's, yes. which hand? That's my left hand. So left to left, mm -hmm. right to right. Bring Nikki forward on her right foot. Yep. And then I turn Nikki clockwise, keeping hold with both hands. The left hand goes behind Nikki's back like so. We go palm to palm. Nikki keeps turning until she comes around to face. The weight goes on my right foot. Weight on the left foot for the ladies. And then as Nikki steps back on, on right. her right, right, I step forward on my left and lower the right hand. So in a nice comfortable position. Mm -hmm. Then we Manhattan. Again, th that's been uh, taught in more detail in one yeah. of our earlier moves. So our right foot stays where it is, my right foot. And left foot for ladies. And I step back on my left. And forward on the right. And Nikki steps with me. Remember, small steps are good steps for yeah. this. So again, weight on the right foot, but step on the left. Weight on the right foot. And here. Now, very important that we're very close together. And we go knee to knee. So my right knee. And my right knee. <laughs> are touching. They're mm -hmm. overlapping at the moment. So we've got literally pressure between yeah. us. Mm -hmm. And we're going to pivot. So no leaning. Do not lean. Just pivot on the spot like so. And you should be able to hold and actually let go of each other without anybody hitting the floor. Okay. So that's not part of the move. Don't let go. <laughs> so from here, we pivot back after a count of three. We pivot back. I let go with my left hand. Raise my right to turn the key clockwise. One, two, lower and step with my partner. Whew, well done for getting through that. <laughs> okay, we're going to teach it from this side. Okay, here we go. Right to right to start. Lead away. I'm stepping left with my left foot, creating space on my right hand side. Pull and raise with the right hand, like so. So we're sort of on feet together, but I'm preparing to take my right foot in. Now remember, very important, do not lower your right hand. As you step and put weight on your right foot, go palm to palm with the right hand. Take your left foot behind you, taking it out of the slot like so. Offer the spare yeah. and we're palm to palm with both hands. Mm -hmm. Right hand high, left hand low. Nikki's got her right foot forward. She's going to turn on that clockwise. Her left arm goes behind her back like so. Right hand goes over her head onto the shoulder. My weight's on my right foot now. As I step forward, as Nikki goes back on the right, I'm forward on the left. So this is the Manhattan position. Then we Manhattan just by moving my left foot, like so. And then we go knee to knee, must be knee to knee. Pivot, like so. Pivot back after a count of three. Let go with the left hand. Raise the right to turn your partner one and a half times clockwise, lower and step back. Oh, there's a lot going on. <laughs> now, we'll just talk about the pivot and, and that actual hold. So, mm -hmm. when we do this move, um, yes, there we go. It's in this position. So, we've done the Manhattan. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The Manhattan gives you a little bit of time to make sure that you're both in sync. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I know Nikki's position relative to mine. And again, when she steps in, okay, my weight is on my left foot so I can pivot and we're knee to knee and nice and close. And again, from this position, we can let go quite easily yep. and pivot back <laughs> without anybody falling over, okay? So no leaning whatsoever yeah. on that move, okay? Now, there's other ways to get into the same move, but this is the catapult version. Mm -hmm. So to account from this side, the whole thing, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And away. Step, raise, turn, Manhattan, two, 
three, and step, pivot, two, three, four, and turn, turn, and back. No idea how many beats that was, <laughs> but let's count it from this side to see what happens. Okay. Here we go. To a count, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen 11, 12, 13, 14 beats. Okay, 14 beats. One more time from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14. 14. It was 14 and a half. <laughs> 14, 15 beats there. Uh, Nikki got round a lot quicker than I thought I on that did. move. Yeah. So uh, okay. she almost stepped back a bit early. Okay. But never mind. So if you like that move, please like, subscribe and share. And we'll see you for the next lesson. Okay. Cheers all. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki. And we're going to be teaching you Manhattan. the Manhattan, the traveling return <laughs> into a Manhattan. We're doing a lot of moves today. So <laughs> okay, looks like this. A lot of moves in the, it's one move. So yeah. uh, yes. So here we go. Guys left to ladies right. Should we show them first? Uh, yes. We're going to show <laughs> you first. <laughs> I'm not well. I okay. <laughs> it looks like this. Seven, eight. Away. Collect. That wasn't a traveling return, was it? Never mind. I know. <laughs> I know, I'm just warming up. Just getting ready <laughs> okay. for the uh, thing. I'll do it again. Here <laughs> the we <real> go. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> Seven, eight, traveling <gasps> return. Uh, that's better. There we go. There we go. I knew I was going to get it right at the end. Okay, this is Manhattan, and then we're going to exit out with a return. Okay. Yes. So, traveling return. I knew that. <laughs> so, guys left, ladies right, down at waist level. We're going to lead our partner with our left hand. So as we normally do, we step to the left, guys, making space on our right. Nikki's back on her right foot. I'm going to raise my left hand. My left hand is going to rotate in Nikki's hand, and we end up palm to palm. As Nikki starts to pass me on my right-hand side, as she does, I come around with my right foot ready to pivot like so. Nikki goes back on the... I'm going to step on my left. Now, I'm watching Nikki as she steps on her left. As she does, I know she's going to step back on her right, and I step in with my left foot so that we're syncopated. Yeah. I think that's what that word means. So then we can do the Manhattan. So, back around this side. We lead away with the left hand. I'm stepping to my left, creating space on my right. Raise my left hand. Hand rotates palm to palm. Now I'm now watching Nikki's feet. I know where her feet are. I'm going to put my weight on my right foot. I'm going to, sorry, it's my fault. <laughs> I'm going to go step left, face my partner, and then I step back on my right. As I step in with my left hand. foot. And yeah. we'll try it from this side. Mm -hmm. So we lead away with our left, create space on the right, raising the left hand. Okay, so ladies, I'm going to step right. I turn, then I step on my left foot. I've stepped in with my right foot, pivoting. And then ready. I step back on my right. And I step forward on Jim's my on. left. So then we're here. From here, we keep, my right foot doesn't move, so it stays perfectly still. And my left foot doesn't move. So my left foot steps back. And my right foot steps forward. So we keep going, like so. So just practice that. So again, my right foot stays stationary, my left foot steps. Now what's important with this move is you do small steps, mm -hmm. not big steps, like so. So this is a horrible Manhattan. <laughs> okay, so the bigger the step, the worse it looks. Okay. And also, you're supposed to move the, the hips to this hips. song. Song? What song? <laughs> okay, to this move. So little steps are good steps. Okay, back around this side. Guys, left, ladies, right, lead away. Raise the left hand. 
Nikki's going under my left arm. I go right, I, uh, ladies. Step left, back on the right. And then straight away, we do the Manhattan. Now, to exit this move, there's multiple types of exit, but what we're going to do is just a, a, a turn clockwise. So we do it from the back position. So I've stepped back on my left foot. Nikki's forward on her... Right foot. I'm going to raise my left hand. My right hand literally leads Nikki under my left arm as she turns clockwise, comes around the face, and we step back. Let's try it from this side. I've got a little tip for you, ladies, as well. So when we get to the turnout, I'll explain what not to do. Okay. We lead away. We collect. We're doing the wrong move again. No, I've been doing the wrong move. <laughs> We'll cut that out in the edit. <laughs> Here we go. Lead away. <laughs> Raise the left hand. Guys, just stop watching me. Watch yeah. Nikki. <laughs> Come round. Ladies, your right, left, and back on the right. Okay. Okay. And so then we small hip. Small steps. There we go. So our hand holds are palm to palm. My right hand is on Nikki's shoulder blade. Mm -hmm. From here, when I'm in the back position, so my left foot is back. Okay, so this is, ladies, this is going to be a, a natural thing you're going to want to do. So as the guy's going to turn you out, what isn't great is if you were to do this. Do you, do you see? So what's going to happen is, <laughs> run out of studio then. Uh, so when you're going round, what we don't want to do is sort of see a, a step, big steps. Because what's going to happen is your guy is going to have to follow you. He's going to have to run after you. So what we want to see is a turn on the spot together, and then he'll lead you back. So it's a spin, pivot yeah. on the spot. Okay, from this side, lead away. Turn. Don't collect. Don't collect. <laughs> I'm so doing a different move. Okay, under the arm, pivot, and Manhattan for one, two, Three, four, raise the left hand, turn and step. Ready nice. for the next move. Mm -hmm. To a count, here we go, if I can get the move right. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Eight beats. Here we go from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Good. From the side again. Okay. Are you going to say something? I was going to say something. I'll say it afterwards. It's okay. fine. Five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. Seven and eight. Okay. So what I was going to say was, we'll, in other videos, we'll show you how to add some flourish or some decoration on this same move. So make sure you check out uh, Manhattan variations that we've got on our Smooth Jive channel. That's what I wanted to say. Perfect. They don't okay. exist yet. So if you're watching we're, this. We're going to do them after this. We will do okay. them. All okay. Right. <laughs> if you like that move, please like, subscribe and share. And we'll see you for the next lesson. Cheers all. Bye. Bye. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today we're going to teach you a lady spin, then a sway lean with a flick. Okay, looks like this. So we demo it first. Seven, eight. Away, prepare, spin, catch, in, and flick. <laughs> Up, turn, and back. Okay, so we'll teach it from this side first. Okay, it's a right to right move, mm -hmm. and we're going to start with the lady spin. So we're going to lead our partner away. I'm stepping to the left on my left foot, creating space on my right hand side. Nikki's back on her right, right foot. foot. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to prepare Nikki for a counter spin. So I lead Nikki forward. She steps forward on the right foot. On the right foot. But then I'm going to spin Nikki clockwise by pulling with the right hand. Now, ladies, you need a bit of tension in this arm in order for it to work. Because if you've got a floppy arm, this is what happens. Nothing, okay? So a nice bit of frame in this arm. I'm going to pull Spinnicky clockwise. Mm -hmm. As she comes around to face, I step back into 
the slot with my right foot, step, and we're right to right when we finish the move. So I'm then going to wrap Nikki into my front. So I'm going to stay in the slot. So I'm going to lead Nikki forwards. My right foot is forward, so I step back on my left. Right foot is forward. Roll the right hand over. So my right hand is now on Nikki's hip. Yeah. Nikki turn clockwise, anti-clockwise to get into this position. I do, yeah. Anti-clockwise to get into the position. Mm -hmm. And I take my left leg out, go palm to palm, right hand on the hip. And I use my, my fore leg here, fore leg. I don't know what that's called. Fore leg, that's not a word, is it? It's forearm. And my, your thigh? my thigh, your my thigh. right thigh, <laughs> my thaw thigh, okay? <laughs> Take it into Nikki, okay? My chest touches, mm -hmm. and then I take Nikki off balance like so. Okay, so what I'm doing, ladies, I'm just stepping with my left foot into the middle of Jim's legs. So again, Jim could let go of me, and I'm holding my own weight, okay? The next thing, when Jim leans back, all I'm going to do is just to give it a little flourish is to do a little flick. So with my right leg, I'm going to do a little up. His so leg. It's almost and back. like you're wiping something off your leg, that's it, ladies. That's exactly onto it. my leg. <laughs> you're not know. kicking him. No. <laughs> you're literally just ro raising your right foot up. He's done. It's quite a tango y style flourish. Okay. Now, my left leg is now killing me because I've held this position. Okay. So, let's, let's get out go. of this. I'm going <laughs> to let go with my left. Gonna, as Nikki steps forward, I'm going to raise my right hand. One and a half turns for Nikki, lower and step away. Oh, shake it off. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's teach you it from this side. <laughs> this side, okay. This side. Okay, we start with a lady spin. Lead away. Mm -hmm. So step into my left. Nikki's back on her right foot. We prepare. So getting ready to spin Nikki clockwise. Spin anti-clockwise. Yeah. <laughs> no, clockwise. No, clockwise. That was clockwise. Yeah. Step in. Okay. Wrap in. Right leg is ready, right hand on the hip, palm to palm with the left, step back. And flick. Flick, and again, I can let go, we're in no danger of falling over here, yeah. okay? L stand up, let go with the left hand, raise that right hand to turn, all the way around to face, lower and, and step back. So let's see what that looks like to a count. Okay. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten beats. Okay. Let's try it from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Can't believe it. Ten beats every time. <laughs> Last time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And away. Prepare. Spin. Right to right. Wrap in. Down. Leg. And turn away. Fantastic. Yay. Well done. If you enjoyed that move, please sub like, subscribe and share. Tell all your friends and we'll see you for the next routine. Cheers. Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive, we're Jim and Nikki. So today we've already shown you how to do the Manhattan move and what we're going to do now is we're not going to do the full teach so you need to look at the other video for that but we're going to show you how you can add a flourish, a bit of decoration on the end of that move. So the Manhattan looks like this but we're going to add the flourish. Seven, eight, away, turn, one, two, three and four. Turn out and step. Yeah. Okay, from this side, left to right, we're gonna lead our partner away, ready for a traveling return. So lead away, I'm forward on my left, Nikki's back on her right foot. My right foot's already starting to create the space on my right hand side. As we start to do the traveling return, which we've taught on its own, mm -hmm. we then step on our right foot chaps, as Nikki steps back on her... What was I? That's your right foot. It was my right foot. I stepped now forward I'm on my left foot. 
Well done. <laughs> From here, we Manhattan. Okay. So one, two, three, four. Well, then we, I'm signaling with my left hand. Now, it, it signals are strange things in dance. Nikki will know if I just squeeze her palm mm -hmm. here that something's going to happen. So a little squeeze on mm -hmm. the left hand. I'm going to bring Nikki in like so. Now, we must be knee to knee. So the knees must be touching. So they literally go side by side like so. Can we show them a little bit? Okay. <laughs> there we go. So knees go. to knee. Okay. That okay. ensures that we're both literally close together mm -hmm. and we're over our core, which means we're in balance. From here, I'm just going to put my left leg out, raise the left hand, and a very slight lean. Okay, but if I let go, Nikki's got her own balance and I've got my own balance. Mm -hmm. So there's no leaning over. Actually, that, yeah. If we did that, we'd be, well, how would it look? I don't even know. No. Oh. <laughs> so okay, from here, I'm just going to raise my left hand over Nikki's head as she steps under my left arm to exit through and we step together. So we'll teach it from this side. Mm -hmm. Left to right, lead away. Create space on the right hand side. As you raise the left hand, I'm going to come in on my right foot. So my weight's on my right foot as Nikki steps Again, left and right. Left and then back on my right. I step in with my left. Okay. We then Manhattan, like so. And squeeze of the hand mm -hmm. to let Nikki know something's going to happen. I pivot on my right foot. My weight's on my right foot. We're knee to knee. Left foot goes out. Left arm goes up. Okay. What I'm going to do, ladies, I'm actually going to look down the line that I've just created. So to make the, <laughs> the decoration a little bit more fancy, what I can do is not only look, but also extend my arm as well. So you get a nice line on the leg, the arm, and the head going down. My leg's really hurting. I know. Okay. I'm going to get out of this up. <laughs> Raise the left hand. Nikki goes under my left arm. My lead comes from my right hand to turn her. We lower and step back. Okay, okay, again from this side. Here we go. Lead away. Raise. Step in. One, two, three, four. Signal. Back. Collect. Now you notice my right leg is straight, chaps. All my weight is over my left leg. We go up. Raise the left hand, turn under, and step away. Nice. Okay, right, let's Are try it again from this side. We'll do okay. it to a count. Okay. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. You're doing two, the wrong, doing the move, wrong move. move again. <laughs> okay, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight, and away. Raise <laughs> and one. Two, three, and raise the left and step. Now, quite often get asked, how long do you stay in that position? <laughs> eh, as long as you like, as long as your leg can take it. Um, mm -hmm. But don't, make, don't go kink, kink, and out straight away. Just make yeah. it look nice. Yeah. So, to a count from this side, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, and eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Uh, uh, give or take. Give or take. Right, from this side. Okay. To a count. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine, ten, 11 and 12. It was 12 times. Nice. 12 beats every time. Okay, last time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine, ten, eleven, and 12. Well done. If you enjoyed that move, please like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you for the next lesson.
Hi, we're Jim and Nikki. Welcome to Smooth Jive. And today we're going to teach you the left-handed Archie. Okay, so uh, this is my nemesis move. It is. Um, it is a move when I became a dance teacher. Um, this was part of the exam. And could I do it? Oh my God, no. <laughs> Nearly failed the course because of this <laughs> move, but I've since perfected it. Um, well, my level of perfection. It looks like this anyway. Seven, eight. There you go. I was concentrating there. No talking. <laughs> <laughs> no talking allowed when I do that move. Okay. <laughs> it's a left-handed archie. So uh, guess what? Left hand mm -hmm. to right hand. In the slot, we're going to lead our partner away. As chaps, you take a step to the left with your left foot. Ladies are back on their right, right foot. foot. Mm -hmm. And I'm creating space on my right-hand side. Now, uh, the key to this move is you need to be very close to your partner as she starts to go down the slot. So I'm going to lead Nikki forward one step. My left hand is, it's not shoulder height. No, uh, elbow, but It's a, it's a elbow comfortable height. height that I know I can now turn Nikki in a clockwise direction. So I'm going to pull with this left hand. Nikki's going to start turning clockwise. Mm -hmm. Now, when she's here, this is where I know I need to take my right shoulder as close to her left shoulder left shoulder as possible okay so i'm coming in here <coughs> losing my voice mm. as i raise my left hand and we go back to back my left hand goes over my head i've stepped in with my right foot i'm then going to turn and face nikki as we lead her away now we'll sh that was a little bit hidden part of that so we'll do it from this mm -hmm. side so I lead away, stepping left on my left foot, creating space. Left hand goes forwards. Nikki's forward on her right foot. Right foot. I pull with my left hand to start Nikki turning in a clockwise mm -hmm. direction. Turn now a we'll, bit. we'll we turn so you mm -hmm. can see. As I raise this, Nikki wants to turn under that arm. And what I do is I follow in behind like so. So my right shoulder comes in, back to back, left hand goes over the head and turn like so. Okay, so mm -hmm. I'll just do it as a demo. There, step, in and out. Actually, I'm going in before you by the looks of it. Mm. So here, here, I'm in before Nikki turns. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. so looks like this when we teach. So it's a step back. Prepare. I'm going to, because I know what I'm going to be doing next, hopefully. As I pull, I start turning first in a anti-clockwise direction, raising my left hand, raise, come round, and then forward. So all the pivoting that I'm doing is being done on my right foot. So again, from this side, lead away, prepare. Turn Nikki in a clockwise yep. direction mm -hmm. as I turn anti-clockwise. So I'm putting my right foot in. That's what I'm going to pivot on. Under, feet together, and then lead away. Like that. <laughs> okay, to a count. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four. Or three. No, I think it's four. Is it? Okay. Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four. Four. It yeah, is four. it is four. Yeah, four beats. Okay. Now Again. you're doing it like that, I'm wondering how you ever got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I was taught in a very strange way. I'm just going to say that. Yeah, Here we go. Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four. Yes. Lovely. Okay, if you like that move, <laughs> remember to subscribe and then you get to see all the other moves that we do. Until then, bye. <laughs>